Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Wayne, here, and today we have something special for you all because we are at Chipotle for they just released a new kind of meat. Their chicken al pastor. Yes, al pastor chicken, which typically I would have thought it would have been pork or lamb, but you know, chicken, that's cool too. Now, I want to do a comparison between the regular chicken and the al pastor chicken. So I got three al pastor tacos and three chicken tacos, all together for a total price of $16.90, including tax, which is $1.39, for a total price of $18.29. So let's go in for a close up. So this is the moment we've been waiting for. This is Chipotle's new chicken al pastor tacos, which is on the right. And on the left, we have Chipotle's regular chicken tacos. And we're going to do a comparison. So starting off, let's look at the regular chicken tacos you can see this so it looks like i kept it as simple as possible just lettuce cheese tomatoes and chicken oh, there's a usual chicken meat grilled nicely it does look pretty good seasoned right and on the right we got the chicken al pastor same toppings as usual but the difference here is the chicken so this is a chicken al pastor as you can see it is really orangish red in color compared to that light brown color of the regular chicken. So that's mainly because they use the achiote seasoning, but hopefully it tastes good, it does look really nice. So with that being said, I'm getting hungry, let's get to tasting. So now that I've got the close up out of the way, let's try the food. But before I get started, make sure to like this video, also subscribe to my channel for more delicious food reviews. And with that being said, first things first, let's get the regular chicken tacos up and show y'all, let me pick it up. This is what it looks like. I try to keep it as simple as possible, mainly because I wanted to taste the natural flavors of the way Chipotle makes their chicken. So all I added was lettuce, cheese, the tomato salsa, and there's a whole bunch of chicken in here. Like, look at this. Look at all that chicken meat. Oh man, this is what the chicken meat looks like if y'all want a close up. Let me take the cheese off. As you can see, this is what it looks nice and brown, seasoned right. It does look tender and juicy, so let's take a bite. Cheers, guys. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, yeah. That always tastes good. As you know, I always like the way Chipotle makes their items. They make their items really good. They have really good quality. And just like the other foods, this tastes really good too. All the ingredients work really well. But especially the chicken. Look at the chicken. Look at how juicy and tender it is. Grilled nicely. Mmm. Look how easily it pulls apart. It pulls apart like nothing. For your body, it's just so soft and tender and juicy. A little bit smoky too. A little bit salty from the seasoning. But overall, it's a good chicken. Like I can see why so many people love the way Chipotle makes their chicken. It's pretty good. But with that being said, we're here to try the Al Pastor chicken. So let's pick this up and oh man, it looks so nice. This is what the chicken al pastor looks like. I got the same toppings, lettuce, cheese, tomato, salsa. But the difference here is the chicken. As you can see, the chicken al pastor, nice and orangish red in color. Oh, that looks so beautiful. But hopefully it tastes good. So let's take a bite. Cheers, guys. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, that is nice. That is nice right there. Like immediately if you take a bite through the taco and reach the al pastor chicken meat, you can tell there's a vast difference between the regular chicken and the al pastor chicken. For instance, the al pastor chicken, immediately you'll notice it's way sweeter. A lot sweeter, mainly because they cook it in pineapple juice, which absolutely is delicious. Meat itself is way softer, way tender, and a lot more juicier too. Mainly because, you know, the pineapple juice, the enzymes from the juice actually breaks down the meat, so it makes it so soft and tender. This is a good piece of chicken. Other than that, you can taste the achiote pet seasonings, a lot of the other seasonings too. It feels a little bit earthy and nutty at times, but not only that, there's also a good amount of kick. Like there's a small kick on the back of the throat, which actually tickles its plate is fun on the spice scale. I'll probably say it's like around uh three or four. It's very small in spice, but it has great taste, great flavor, pairs perfectly well with all the rest of the taco. Oh, the chicken al pastor is actually pretty good. But with that being said, I don't know if I would go to Chipotle just specifically to get the al pastor chicken tacos, mainly because you know. I'm more used to the al pastor being pork or lamb, and I would much rather go to a local Mexican authentic traditional restaurant and get an al pastor meat over there that's probably pork or lamb. It tastes way better and probably way cheaper too. But with that being said, you know, if you still want to go to Chipotle and want to try the chicken al pastor taco, it is pretty good. And I think you all will really enjoy it because it does taste amazing. It's basically just a sweeter version of the regular chicken with a little bit of a earthy sensation. 
Very nice. I quite like it. I think you all will too. So with that being said, what would I rate Chipotle's new Al Pastor chicken meat? I would definitely say it gets a 7.9 on the scale. You know, it's very good. It's so soft, tender, juicy, way more tender, way more juicier than the regular chicken. And it's a lot more sweeter too. It's just way more flavorful. Overall, it's a very good chicken meat. Great job, Chipotle. You guys did a good job. So with that being said, all I have to say is that, you know, if you want to go to Chipotle and try out their new chicken al pastor meat, I will say, yeah, go ahead. It tastes really good if you have the money to spend because it is a little bit pricier than, you know, if you were to get al pastor at a regular Mexican restaurant. But if you have the money to spend, it's not bad. It works well in a taco. I'm pretty sure it works well in a bowl. And it's very good. It's flavorful and it's delicious. I think y'all really like it. But with that being said, that basically ends the video. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Be sure to like comment, share the videos with all your friends and family. Also, if you haven't done so already, please be sure to subscribe to my channel because, you know, I'm a small YouTuber. Any support does mean a lot. And with that being said, that's about it. So, I'll see you later.